is here with more tonight. That's right, Joanna. Teachers say on Monday a fight was so severe they saw blood and hair on the floor, and they say not one member of the administrative team came to see if the students and teachers were okay after that fight on Monday or if the situation had been stabilized, and they say things only got worse after Monday. Tuesday, the Buffalo Teachers Federation says there were 10 fights at River High, Riverside High School, but the school district says there were only five. Either way, the chaos and disruption was so bad, the school went on lockdown. The fights all between girls and on different floors inside the building, and it made it hard for security to get to those fights quickly. Now, teachers demanding for more guards. Tuesday was a, a different day. My 12 years here at Riverside, it was a, the first time I, I've ever actually felt like the building was going to lose control. If the public saw these fights, which are all captured on the 200 cameras in that building, if the public saw these fights, they would be horrified at what happened here on Tuesday. And it just isn't on Tuesday. It's been happening all year. The teachers union now demanding an emergency task force be created within seven days. They want that task force to come up with a new security plan by the end of the month that includes support programs for the students that are involved in these brawls. The union says there are four security guards stationed at the school, but they say that those guards respond to upwards of 80 calls per day and they need more help. Reporting live in the studio, Kendra Eaglin, 7 Eyewitness.